morning, you guys. <laughs> hey, everyone. How's everyone doing today? I hope all is well with each and every one of you guys. So today we are coming in with a hollow taco haul. And we're going to do a little bit of a swatching because I need to start swatching these colors as I purchase them. Because you guys, I've got too many colors. Um, too many polishes that I've been that I have purchased within I don't know. And I have a lot of polish that I need to swatch. So anyway, that is what we're gonna do today. But before anything, I want to show you what is on my nails today. So what you guys think? Anybody know what's on my nails? I'm gonna give you guys a few minutes to think about it and to Comment down below, what do you think this nail polish? I will give you the brand name at least, Orly, Orly. And all of you OGs better know what this one is. That's all I got to say. <laughs> if y'all don't know what this is, I got some stuff to say to you. But nah, anyway, you guys, um, this is Orly's Vintage. Yeah, Vintage. And it has that old purple top. Remember this purple top back in the day, y'all? So anyway, yep, Vintage by Orly. And then also I do have a topper on two of my fingernails, which is gonna be kind of hard to see. But if you guys want to see this full manicure, you're gonna have to check out my Instagram, which is MamaStyles85. If you don't know already, you better know. And it will be down below for you to go ahead and check Um. To go ahead and get my Instagram and so that way you guys can head over there and, you know, stay update with that. Now, I'm going to be honest, I'm not posting a whole lot over there right now. So just bear with me because right now all I've been doing is really my own nails. But anyway, okay. So Orly and then the topper that's on these two last fingers, which is the ring finger and the pinky. I have on Ella Colors, Color Pop in the... And the color extra extra so okay there that looks a lot better okay you guys can see that so it has a bunch of matte glitters in it they're hex glitters actually these big huge so you got a soft baby pink you got a soft baby blue in there you got a soft um hex what is it no i think these are like grass green i would say um no maybe no, not sage. I would say grass green um, little glitters, but it's a very um, light and not, I'm not going to say sparse, but um, it's not heavy glitter, but it is um, in a clear base. And yeah, I thought this would be so cute because it's so soft, but it's so dainty at the same time. It's kind of hardy. It's kind of hard to see. You know what I mean? So yeah, that's what I've got on my nails today i love this color i love it i love it i love it i am so ready for summer at least that's what i say so anyway all right like i said we have a dun, 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 dun. we have a hollow taco little little and when i say a little haul little haul because you guys know if you guys know anything about these little boxes you only know that three polishes come in there and i only purchased <laughs> all right so you guys i'm gonna pull out the first one and the first one is i don't know i don't know the name of it hold on let me open it up okay so this is by that uh the new the new collection what is it that ice cream one I don't know what it was called. Forgive me, you guys, but it was that ice cream one. So this one is Brownie Points. I had to get this chocolate. Like, I know we are not in fall. Winter's technically, technically over, but, you know, we're still experiencing here in Virginia some cold days and, you know, some really rainy and, well, no, spring is about rain, but, you know, cold days, I'll say. And, but... At the end of the day, I was like, oh my gosh, I have to have this though. Because this chocolate, this is a gorgeous brown. Tell me this is not like that perfect brownie. 
So I don't have a brown like this. Now I have other browns that are like this, but they have like a shimmer that runs through it or something like that. I just wanted a cream and this one looks like it it's gonna do what it needs to do. So that was brownie points. I'm gonna go ahead and give you guys some hand candy right there. Okay, and then the next one that I picked up was this one. Now, I think this one's an older one. I've always seen this one and wanted it. Oh my gosh. Oh, you guys, this is so pretty. I wanna say, this, isn't this an old one? This one is royalty blue. Isn't this like from the way beginning when um, Simply Logic, Simply Logical, right? When she um, when she first launched launched her Hollow Talk online, wasn't this one of the blues that was in it? Like one of them. It was very close to the. It was the one of the first or very close to the first launches. I could have sworn this was this was the blue. If it is, please let me know, y'all. But isn't this gorgeous? So, you guys, this is all I purchased. And I know you're like, okay, that's it. Well, okay, click off. But no, we're going to chit-chat a little bit. Come on now. So, anyway, um, this is my first time purchasing actual polish. Now, I have purchased, um, like I said, this from Holo Taco, this matte, as you can see, Holo Taco. And then I've also purchased, um, oh, I don't think I showed you guys, but I did purchase um, her. I think these are her dotting tools. Are these her dotting tools? Or is this from um, Paula's Pickle? Oh my goodness. I can't remember if these were her dotting tools that I got. I could have sworn these are her dotting tools that I bought. Love these dotting tools. Like really, they're very good, sturdy. Um, if I'm not mistaken, it is from Hollow Taco. And then I bought something. Oh, I bought a cleanup brush, which I lent it out. And I, yeah, girl, we already know that. I'm not going to get that back if you lend it out. And it's been months. So anyway, that's, this is all I have ever bought from Hollow Taco. And it's not that I never, you know, wanted to or anything like that. It, it's not that. It's just there was other things that I wanted to get and yeah and i not only that like aren't these 11 11 ounces no 11 mls yeah millimeter yeah no these are 12 they're 12 and um so these are 12 mls but i've always heard that once you get closer to halfway down her bottle it gets very gloopy with a lot of her polishes because she used very very pigmented um, colors which that's great and I mean I'm be honest like all of her launches and the colors look very rich you know what I mean in color but I have issues if I'm gonna get like somewhat halfway down and I'm always having to stick thinner in in a polish so I just kind of would like sat back but I couldn't help it I had to do this well this is the one that really did it was this this brown right here I, everybody that was swatching this was like this is a very good brown so yeah, so it's these two. So we're going to go ahead and swatch these real quick. So, yeah. So any, anyway, you guys, what's been going on? How was y'all's um, eclipse day? Because that is exactly what just happened a couple days ago, like three days ago. Did you guys get the chance to um, check it out or anything? Did you guys purchase those little funky glasses and whatnot? Um, unfortunately I was sick. Um, so I did go outside for a second, but it wasn't, this is pretty. Dang, this look like a one coat girl. This is one y'all. This is one. Okay. See, this is what my hand behind it. This y'all. Mm -mm -mm. That is pretty. I'm going to do two coats just to see, but Damn, forgive me for saying, but this looked like it may be a one coder. Okay, so we're gonna put that there. But anyway, um, yes, we um we didn't purchase the glasses or anything like that. Um, everywhere around us, they were sold out. Um, I could have done it online, but obviously, um, I should have done that way ahead of time. But like I said, I was sick, so um, I just wasn't in the mood for very much of anything. 
And yeah, so y'all, that was the deal with that. So um, my question to y'all is like, when it comes to the eclipse, like what was the, like, was it an emotional moment for you guys? Because I was watching a lot of videos and there was this one um, that I came across it was this broadcaster and he was so emotional over it. And, you know, when anybody's emotional, I, I'm not that one to sit up there and be like, why is this fool laugh? I mean, not laughing. Sorry. Why is this fool crying over this? It's not that deep. I'm never going to be the one to tell you guys that is not that deep. Now, now, if you feel like it's deep and I don't, then that's your opinion. But that, you know, that's that's what you're entitled to. But in this aspect, I, I wanted to know why he felt so, you know, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Like he was so connected to it and he was just like moved by it. And he was just kind of like, you know, I've, I've never seen this before. And, you know, it, it was just a once in a lifetime moment. And it, he was like, it just gave me sh chills and it was just kind of moving. And it was like, wow, okay, well, Maybe I'm not deep enough, you know, or maybe I'm too sick right now to to feel anything because I was just so like, uh, I had a stomach bug, you guys. So I was not in the mood for very much of anything. But, you know, were, were you guys moved by the eclipse? Like, did you guys have an eclipse party? Like you got with friends, family or whatnot? Y'all look at how pretty this is. It is gorgeous too. Of course. This is really pretty, really, really pretty. You know what I think I should start doing? Because I've seen some of you ladies do this. Instead of painting the top part, maybe I should start painting the bottom so I don't have to put a top coat on everything. Do you guys do that? I mean, I've seen a lot of women do that. That's so pretty. That's so pretty. So, yeah. Um, so, yeah, it was just, for me... Um, I wish I could have experienced it. We weren't in the line of 100% total um, darkness. We were in between 80 and 90%. And it did kind of somewhat get a little dark, but it wasn't like dark. You know, like how everybody was like, you know, what I was thinking 80 to 90% in my area. I'm in Virginia, you guys. So, I thought we were going to get a lot more darkness in our area. So I'm going to be honest, we were not no 80. I think we were closer to like 70 between like 70s. I'll say that. But anywho, um, yeah. So the next time we'll see an, a total eclipse. An, an, no, not, not a total eclipse. Um, when, it, when did they say the next time the eclipse will happen again, you guys? I can't remember. Like I said, I've been kind of MIA, you guys. I've been ugh. So anyway, we got we're gonna go ahead and go right in ooh, again with this brownie points, you guys. Ugh. So I'm noticing with brownie points, I did the first coat, and I know this is not a texture polish, but it has some kind of um it's not a glossy finish at all. This is like a uh a, a uh, would you say this is a satin? It's not a matte. It's a, maybe a, more of a satin finish. You guys can see what I'm saying? It's not shiny. It's definitely not glossy. So anyway, let's go in here with this. Yeah. All right. So yeah, that was the deal with the Eclipse. I wish um, I had a better experience and a, something fun to tell you guys. Like, oh, we had a... All our friends got together and we went to such and such because, you know, but no, we didn't. We just hung out, whatnot. Okay, see that? You see how glossy that is? I'm going to show you this right here because this one, you see how glossy the, the um, brownie points is? And then um, this blue one is, is starting to um, dry. It's like a semi glossy finish you guys so yeah so anyway um yeah that was the deal with that so what is everybody doing for what's what's the next holiday memorial yeah i think it's memorial so what are you guys doing for memorial holiday i ain't doing nothing y'all forgive me my son's upstairs the oldest um he's on the phone i think 
I think he's on the phone, yeah. But yeah. I kind of went over the line. Oopsie. But yeah. There we go. Let's do that. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and make a label for this as well. But you guys, this, I don't want to get to like really talking a whole lot because I really don't have a whole lot to say in this video. It was just really meant for this. And it was a little chit chat, but I'm going to go ahead and make a label. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.